The world's first postage stamp, the one penny black, was coated on the reverse side with an adhesive made from potato starch. Only once the adhesive was moistened would the stamp stick to the envelope. Who knows, would we still want to use postage stamps if they weren't first coated with adhesives? But although this concept has shown itself to be a huge success for postage stamps, it isn't so familiar in industrial manufacturing. Certainly, there is a great deal of interest in bonding two components, inexpensively and reliably using adhesive. But as Tucker GmbH and Giesen discovered when it went looking for an alternative to liquid adhesives, none of the manufacturers approached currently offered any such solution. Only the Fraunhofer Institute for Manufacturing Technology and Advanced Materials, IFAM in Bremen, proved to be a suitable development partner. Researchers there have developed a completely new concept for applying adhesive to parts prior to assembly. The primary problem is that people want a solid adhesive that on the one hand has a long shelf life and on the other a very short hardening time. This contradiction had to be overcome. First, during storage, which may last months, the surface must remain non-adhesive because otherwise the parts might stick to each other. But then it must be possible to activate the adhesive within a few seconds when parts are to be joined together. The hardening reaction is activated by quickly heating the substance. Rapid heating is achieved using induction, microwaves or infrared emitters. Critically, the bond must be absolutely reliable and withstand extreme loads. Fraunhofer researchers have succeeded with a completely new approach by combining resins and hardening agents that hot melt at different melting points. During manufacture and application of the adhesive onto the part, the temperature is set to ensure that the substances don't completely mix. That takes place only later, when the parts are joined at a higher temperature. Then the hardening agent becomes liquid, the two substances mix and the adhesive hardens completely. Reactive adhesives are stable only for a limited time, however. That's why the Fraunhofer experts developed a built-in visual monitoring system. If the adhesive is stored for too long or incorrectly, it changes colour. We see particular potential for this development in areas in which separating the application of the adhesive and the actual hardening in time and space can lead to a significant overall increase in productivity. This is absolutely the case with adhesive bolts in automotive manufacturing and has already successfully been put into practice at Tucker GmbH. This has had the effect of expanding the company's value-added chain. Bonding is an essential method for modern lightweight construction because the need to combine a variety of materials frequently rules out other joining techniques. Pre-applied adhesive greatly simplifies the customer's manufacturing process. Our process bears the brand name PASA, which stands for Pre-Applicable Structural Adhesives. It's the result of a holistic approach to research, which stretches from a molecular understanding to include knowledge of industrial production needs. I'm convinced PASA will contribute hugely to a great number of industrial adhesive technology applications.